Who can expect me not everywhere I go in Oh, nice, nice. But that's really good. That's my own. That's my, really good. When your people are different, are gifted differently. Very different, yeah. Kuna mm. mkwara kujapa. But yeah, that angle you took. Yeah, angle. Mimi mm. na take your angle. There is someone in Manyara kujapa na take angle the science. Oh, yeah. Maybe there are some listeners who are not even yeah. Christians. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, science, we are going to help to a certain extent. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Hello everyone, welcome to Suba Talks with myself, Elvina Majiwa. This is a platform where I will be talking to professionals in different fields about the harms that alcohol and tobacco cause and will also be encouraging healthy lifestyle choices. So uh, welcome, subscribe and uh, let's keep this conversation going. So today I'm with MC Joe, Kaibu Sana. Kaibu. So MC Joe, tell us about yourself. And how did you get the name MCJO? <laughs> okay, okay. I remember when uh, when I started music, I, I used to, to have a lot of names. Like today, I have this name when I was in, when I was in primary. I change. I get another cool name. I change. Ah! Until I reached a point where my name is Johnson Manik. Okay. So I just decided to call myself MC John. And it's simple. Mm -hmm. But now when I went home, there's a, a a, a cousin of mine is, is called Francis Maniki, a Maniki like me. Mm -hmm. So I told him now I'm called MC Joe, but uh, he just decided to call me MC Joe, MC Joe, MC Joe. Ah! He doesn't want to call me MC Joe. Uh -huh. So I just decided to go with the name MC, MC Joe. Joe. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so MC Joe, yeah. um, you love music, you only really produce music. Yeah. Um, apart from music, what else do you like? What else do you enjoy doing? Me, I'm a marketer. I love marketing. Mm -hmm. yeah. What product? Okay. Uh, like right now, I'm in real estate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. That's interesting. So you're merging real estate and also your music. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, so in your sober talks, we talk about you know healthy lifestyle choices. So have you always lived a sober lifestyle? Yeah, for me, uh, I've just, to be honest, all my life, like uh, for me, I was brought up in church. I, the first time I got to say that I was in Sunday school. So I can say I have lived a sober life all my life. Mm -hmm. And in the music industry, have you seen the effects that um, those who you know, don't live a sober life, um, have you seen those effects um, on them? Yeah, I've seen effects on them, because, uh, you know, for those, uh, everyone wasn't lucky like me to get said that at a young, a young age. Or, or maybe, there are also those who got saved at a young age, but as, a, as they, they grew up, mm -hmm. they diverted. But by grace of God, me, I can just say I've been able to stand by the grace of God mm -hmm. because I, I have even seen even that uh, children of pastors or uh, church elders mm -hmm. who divert and uh, yeah, start drinking and all such manner of things. Mm -hmm. So I, I can just say it's by grace of God. Mm -hmm. So now when someone come, comes back, sometimes it's usually a struggle. Mm -hmm. Because, uh, you know, uh, righteousness is a gift and it, um, it, you first uh, get righteousness and, that, and then now you start manifesting it. So, some people uh, immediately they get saved, they stop smoking, they stop drinking, some people take, take a while because uh, it's all by grace. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You get saved, maybe three days later, you find yourself smoking, you, you return and then you decide you never smoke again until, uh, until maybe you, you get to a point where now mm -hmm. you are totally delivered. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so I have seen uh, some artists mm -hmm. That uh, gospel artists yeah, yeah. that uh, are struggling with, with, the, with the drugs, mm -hmm. but uh, I don't, I don't like 
I don't judge them harshly mm. because even me I understand the reason why I'm able to be sober is just by the grace of God. Mm. So um, I've seen what uh, drugs has done in their lives. Mm. Is that something you're doing to help them uh, recover? Okay, you, you know, for me, I believe some things are spiritual. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes, even the, the drinking, we can try counseling, we can try everything, mm -hmm. but we find that it doesn't work. But now, when that phase now, we we'll go to, to, to the other thing now, that is deliverance. Mm -hmm. Because uh, some, some, uh, some things people struggle with, it's, it's, it's something that is demonic. Mm -hmm. So you may try psychology, you may try everything else, and uh, it fails to work. But now, when uh, you go the deliverance way, it works. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So meet me for me when I find when when I find anyone. Okay, I don't deal. I don't like dealing with the problem from the from the branches. Mm -hmm. Me, I like going for. Mm -hmm. for the good. Mm -hmm. Because uh, for me I'll just give you the word. The word of God. I'll just keep on keep on giving you the word, the word because uh, the word of God is powerful. Mm -hmm. So you're minister you're a minister of the word of God yeah, through your yeah. music. Yeah. And you recently launched an EP. Yeah. What's your favorite song? Uh, <laughs> my favorite song is uh, uh, all the songs. All the songs you have to I'm not my favorite. You have to have one, one favorite one. Okay. So, no, this is this one maybe you're composing and you really fancy. Okay, I think the one that uh, I love listening to a lot is uh, Anaweza. Anaweza. Yeah. I hope you don't mind dropping a bit for us. Mungu wangu anaweza. Yawe anaweza. Mungu wangu anaweza. Ah, ah. He can uh, an anaweza, anaweza kutoa kwa addiction and drugs. Nice, aha. Uh -huh. Anaweza kutoa kwa addiction and drugs and okay. find you kwa soba mm. by his grace. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay, so what's coming up for Nsiju this mm. year and um, next year? Okay. okay, this year let's just anticipate for the 15th of the school. Okay, aha. Uh -huh. That is the project that I am on. It's a, it's a project that I'm focusing on, mm -hmm. but 15 cities is, is the... Okay, so for those who don't know what 15 cities, please explain to them more about 15 cities. Okay, 15 cities is a tour that I am, uh, I'm, I'm doing as an artist to different counties, preaching and evangelizing the gospel of salvation using music as a tool. Mm -hmm. So it's a, a series of mega concerts that uh, will, will be able to impact many young and old people. Mm -hmm. And are you looking to uh, collaborate with anyone in the music industry this year? Yeah, I'm looking. I, I'm, I, even the EP I've co collaborated, I've done two collaborations. Uh -huh. And uh, I'm looking forward to collaborating with the other many artists oh, nice. from different backgrounds. Mm -hmm. Even vernacular. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. And promoting sobriety, will it be part of your agenda? Um, what role would you play? For me, as I told you, mm -hmm. I deal with it. I go for the roots. Mm -hmm. Because I have discovered when you just come and tell a person, you stop drinking, stop smoking, mm -hmm. that doesn't help. Yeah. But I will just come direct and give you the word. Mm -hmm. When I give you the word, the word will start transforming you. And with time, the more the more you continue feeding on the world, the more you continue being transformed. And at the end of the day, you will hate those things. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. But because but now if I come and start telling you you stop drinking and stop smoking, it doesn't help. I have seen it from high school to university, I've seen it. It doesn't help. So as we close, um, what would be your advice, you know, to your fans, mm. uh, your followers, uh, someone who's watching and is struggling with alcohol and uh, tobacco, 
and um, they really want maybe to even listen to gospel music, to venture into gospel music. Yeah, yeah what would you tell them? I just welcome them to, to salvation mm -hmm. because uh, it's a work in progress. You receive the gift first, and then the and and then now God helps you by His grace to overcome okay. these challenges okay. because we find it's harder to you know um, there is a, a song that uh, that is it's not in the EP. Christian King featuring, featuring me. I've tried to reach out to, you know, sometimes we, we go to evangelize and, and then find a person who is telling you, hey man, me, I, I can't get saved. I would be, it's like, I'm joking. I'm joking with God. Mm -hmm. Because they have, um, uh, they have a mentality that you, you first become righteous. Mm -hmm. You first stop drinking. Mm -hmm. You first stop chewing with you first stop smoking, and then now you can uh, get saved and go to church. Mm -hmm. Me, I can say that is a life of the devil because the devil has been ar around for for a couple of years, mm -hmm. and he is a master. He's a master in in, in lying. He can show you how you you are very sinful, but Jesus uh, wants you to come the way you are. And with his power and his grace, he will he will empower you to be able to, to be able to to stop these things mm -hmm. because it's not by might, not by power, mm -hmm. but by by the spirit of God. Mm -hmm. I have seen people come to church mm -hmm. still struggling, but after some time, they transform. Them. The world transforms them, mm -hmm. and they become different. I also have a, a, um, a DJ, a DJ friend of mine, I won't mention the name. Mm -hmm. By the time he started coming to church, even on Sundays, he used to be to, to, to come to church with an home. Mm -hmm. But now it was a work in progress. As time progressed, he stopped, stopped uh, drinking on Saturdays. Mm -hmm. And he stopped drinking any other given day. Mm -hmm. So it's something that I have seen guys struggling with. Uh, smoking, but when they get the word, mm -hmm. the word of God, uh, the Bible says that the, the word of God is, is very powerful. You know the word of God can even even get to places that a surgeon can never get. Mm -hmm. Division of, of, of spirit and the soul. The, the, there's no surgeon who can get those uh, those dimensions. Mm -hmm. So the word of God, the word of God, the word of God is powerful. Mm -hmm. So when you are feeding it, you are getting transformed. Mm -hmm. And uh, where can people listen to your music from? Um, yeah. my, my EP is on Audio Mac. You can just Google uh, Wakatu Wamungu the EP on Audio Mac. It's also on YouTube. My YouTube channel is uh, MC Joe. My on Facebook, I'm MC Joke E. Twitter, MC Joke E. Instagram, MC Joke E. Thank you so much, MC Joe. You're much welcome. Yes. Thank you so much for coming. And, Thank you for the <laughs> for the invitation. I'm honored. Kashibu Sanda. Yeah. And maybe after 15 cities, you can come back and tell us how that experience was. Definitely. Sawa sawa. Thank you guys so much for watching Sober Talks with myself, Alvina Majiwa. Please remember to comment uh, and subscribe to this channel so that we continue this conversation. Bye, see you on the next episode.